Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to another PGA Tour Community Challenge and today I'm going to be mixing up two suggestions that I got. One of them is from Bosox Fan Gaming 16 which is um, in Coyote Falls only use a 7-iron but I'm going to have to change that because on the seven, with, if, with my, if I'm just using a 7-iron on Coyote Falls I can't reach across most of the canyons so we're just going to be going into every single canyon and we actually won't be able to get any sort of score i'll be seven over on one hole which was the which was the score he was trying to trying to get me to get but i'm going to do this uh, 18 or h higher mile an hour wins we'll do that coyote falls any character of my choice ricky fowler and then we're going to mix it with uh Jaiman patel suggestions which is coyote falls ricky or healy highest winds driver tree hybrid seven iron any wedge and a putter so um what we'll do is we'll take out the wedge and we'll take out the three hybrid we'll just do driver seven iron and a putter okay so driver seven iron putter i'm just adding a, a driver uh to your suggestion um bosox fan gaming 16 so thank you for the suggestion it's, it's actually awesome but i just can't reach it i tried it and i was like 16 over after seven holes so i really um I appreciate all the suggestions. This is what we're going to be doing in this part. In the next part, I might do the St. Andrews uh, Highest Wins Challenge and try and shoot under par or whatever it is. Uh, true uh, British Lynx Golf. So we're going to jump into this one and we'll try it here. Ricky Fowler, I think they just done a patch here and he's 88 now instead of 86. So that's cool. He was the only player that had his rating shit. I'm pretty sure he was 86 before, right? So I, th I think they boosted him for some reason. Um, but this is going to be incredibly hard to do anyway. So 7 over is apparently the score I have to get, but... Highly unlikely. Highly unlikely. We've we're two and zero on our record right now. Um, it's what is it? Um, a, uh, the Pops Masters and Battlefield Challenge and the Hole in One Challenge. We both completed them. So after this, we're probably going to be two and one. But what are you going to do? Um, we'll try it anyway. We'll try our best. We might be able to do something. Richard Fowler, let's do it. Okay. Okay. <sighs> feeling it i'm feeling the power okay let's do this let's freaking do this presented by ea sports in association yeah yeah with yeah yeah par 73 today we're here at so we need to shoot we need to shoot an 80 or better canyon arizona rich learner alongside frank novolo for ea sports set to bring you all the action i don't know if he said anything about tour mode or anything frank, what can you tell us about it we'll, we'll just play on tour mode fuck it for many uh, 17 million years to be uh, precise rich but uh, thanks to our design team from ea sports we have a brand new venue just over eight thousand oh please stop stop weave its way across and around the canyon and of course uh. the penalty for missing fairways here well, let's just say Canyon Rific. Oh, that's okay, actually, because we can play out here. The wind will burn back. Years and Seven iron. Plus yards. Numbers you don't hear every day in the game of golf. 144 is what we are. So, about full loft. I'm bringing this back to about 150, maybe, out of this rough. We'll try 158, because that's what the back of the green is. Oh, that's too big. Needs to sit. This Needs to sit. Look at that wind. Whoa! It looks like it's going to be in the rough. All right. This is craziness. Playing this par four still. Right. We can par this. Come on. We can par this. Shot. That's still not done. Um, if it changed to a maybe seven iron. Right. Okay, we'll play this about here, maybe. Put full loft on this shit and play it like a thirteen yarder. Stop, stop, please stop, please stop, please stop. Right, so we, we might have a chance for a par here on the first leads. Sorry if my camera is shitty, by the way. Okay, yeah, come on, Ricky. You can do this. Ah! That's a poor putt damn it! We needed that one the on the first here. Settles in over the putt. It's a bogey on the first, damn it. This is going to be difficult, man. Round. This Ooh, is the this is gonna be tough. Three, I'd be surprised if we got 18 over on this, honestly. Get lost there to the right. Well, that's for sure. It looks like an old uh, ruins of an old fort there. 285 yards though, but we are at 285. A little bit off for that. Plus, the green is some 36 feet below the level of the tee. So we should really, really be playing this with full law. 
off of that. The two front bunkers, they really say. Oh, I can't go down. Anything. What am I doing? And that green, as you can see, is a, a perfect circle. We'll play at like 270, maybe. Look at that wind, though. That's crazy. I'm just hoping for the best with this one. Oh, that's not bad. That's not bad. Oh, just if we had been a foot further, that would have been a really good shot. We can save power here. Come on. Up and down with the 7 iron. Come on. Come on. We can do this. The two greatest ever are probably Gary Player and Seve Ballesteros. Seve actually was so good, he was so skilled that he could open up We're just going to hit the lip here, are we? That's right, a 3 iron. On a short bunker oh, shot shit. from a green side bunker and I thought we were just going to hit the lift. Feet, as if he had just used a 60 degree sandwich. Amazing. Oh yes, we okay. needed that one. We needed that one. That's a par. Right, par 5. This is not an easy par 5 though. So 7 over is the score to beat. We can do it. Oh, not this par 5. Jesus fucking Christ, dude. There's no worse hole in the world than this one. No joke. You this whole fucking right sucks. Frank, this is a really cool looking tee shot, isn't it? It's very intimidating. You can hit it either left That's a really good right tee shot, though. Either way will work. That's like either really good. Right, you're going to have to cut that second shot. This is like hitting it down a railway line. So. Hard left doesn't look that good to me. We're going to have to play out here, aren't we? If we play it off the cliff there. It's going to come back in either way, right? So let's just fucking do it. Oh, that's really good. If it comes, don't go down the canyon. Just don't go down the canyon, whatever you do. Please don't go down the... Okay, we're alright. Okay. Alright. It's fine. Now the third shot at the 212. We have to go with a 7 iron, though. We can get... We could go with our driver, but nah. Let's just be short. Let's just be short. It's gonna, still gonna hit the wall. Look how far I left way in there. Oh crap! That might go on the green. Go on, hit the rock and go on the green. Oh, I thought it might hit the rock, hit the canyon, then hit the rock, then go on the green. But apparently we're we hit we're in the middle of a rock now, so this is not good. Nick, good friends. Okay. This is gonna be hard because it's gonna be really hard to get the get this to land on the green and stop. Okay, so we're, we're, is it 11 yards onto the green? 11 yards, so we need to play this like 12, maybe. Well, oh, that's a, that's a little absurd See, this is what it's impossible to get the loft hard, proper. It's come up, uh, well okay, we're short. for par here. Didn't appear committed through impact. Oh, really? Didn't appear, appear committed, did I? Look how that just shot right. Good shot right there. It's going to be a bogey, unfortunately. We're not doing too bad, even though we got two bogeys. This is incredibly difficult. You don't even realize, guys. Yes. Okay. Alright, two over. We can afford five more bogeys. I think ten over is a better score to try and beat, but... Whatever, you made the challenge, guys. Okay, guys, like, there's... If we hit driver, we're going to go too far here. The only thing I'm thinking is... What if we smack it off the canyon at the back there? Like absolutely destroy it. Full loft on it. Okay, so what is it at the back of the canyon? 255. So if we play this like a... Maybe a 266 something. I'm just going for it. I don't give a shit. Gotta take risks. Yes. Stop there now. Stop there. Oh, kind of went and in the rough. Rolls just into the rough. Now you have to decide whether or not that ball's going to fly or not. Second oh, this shot is where it gets hard. These kind of shots, because like, I should have done the any one wedge, because this is going to be too hard. Fuck it. Let's change it to the any one wedge, right? Okay. I know that's making it a little bit easier, but it's going to be impossible otherwise. All right, we're going to hit. It's going to be a fifty-nine degree wedge, okay? So I can use a 59 degree wedge, 7 iron, and a driver. That's it. I promise you that's it. I'm not going to make any more. I'm sorry guys, but it's going to be too hard with just a 7 iron. Oh, it looked like you caught a flyer right there, Frank. Well, I probably would have oh, done better with the 7 iron there, honestly. Way too much. 
Frank, it hit the green, but just didn't have enough backspin. Yeah, it, uh, you, you wonder what he was thinking on that. Because we'll be here, like, we'll, we will not get so a tester from freaking feet. seven over if we don't use a wedge. It's just a fact. Two over for the day. We're going to be, like, 12 over, maybe. Easily. Wow, look at this drop, Frank. Not only do you need the right stick, but you probably need a parachute just to get... Seven <laughs> to iron, okay. Here. This... Right, it's almost like we're going to be well short here with this, but... It is I'll take it, because... From the tee, we have a wedge to use at least. We don't have to go straight over the back with this seven iron. Yards away. That is some free fall. It's gonna be well short, but whatever. All right, that's fine. On the fairway, we can get up and down with these with this wedge now. Frank, you like his chances to walk away with a par here? Well, with a good shot, Rich. Yeah, that's certainly on the cards in that. And um, and you think you just ride a par down at the end of the end of the hole? Don't tell anyone about it. It certainly won't affect the scorecard at the end of the day. So <laughs> that's the goal right here. You kidding me? Always so disappointed. The wind affected that forty yarder. When you come up short. Yeah, you look. Oh, okay. And one, there's absolutely no so way I'm getting to this, unfortunately. Flag, uh, Sorry, guys, but test for the short game. You might as well chuck this down as a freaking. See, that I knew that. In the bunker. Uh, well, this is a play. This is a double bogey man. already. Still in the but they put us back down. Fill up his shoes with sand. Oh come the fuck on, dude! There's no way I can get out the there. It's in the rough, thank that's God. Difficult lot. That's the only way I could have got out there. Remember, out of the rough. Expect the ball to jump forward. Fuck a that bunker. Bit. This is for a double bogey, too, guys. Fuck. Still one left. Wow. Well, once you hit double the, the stance. To just pick up Triple bogey, guys. Five over. <laughs> Unfortunately, you might as well chalk this down to this being a fail now. <laughs> oh, fuck, you know. Somehow underneath the arches from there, you're hitting well to an island green, you might say. There's no water. It's just surrounded by rock and canyon. All right, it's okay. Good tee shot. Good lie. Now a good chance to take advantage here on this hole. Looks like he's going to have a go at it here at the par five. The second shot. Wait, you think we should hit driver here? Fuck this, I'm hitting driver here. I honestly just don't give a single fuck right now. That's how I'm feeling. Oh yeah. That's how I'm that's how I'm playing. That's how I'm playing. Alright. We might have, if we can make a birdie or two, we might have a chance. We can't use this club though, unfortunately. Is the seven iron going to be re more realistic to get there? Because we're never getting there with this. Seven iron and cuts them off. Full loft, 160 play, like a 145 maybe? From the clothes to the hair to the swing to the swagger. Fowler, he's... Just a different kid, and I mean, people Shit. love him. Everywhere you go, Frank, at a tour event, it's a birdie butt, though. Kids with the, I guess. the wide brim hats and the orange shirts, orange head to toe. He's become a phenomenon on the golf course. He has. When I grew up in New Zealand, the orange boy was the, the kid that came out in half time to actually give out the oranges. Orange boy has a totally different meaning now. Can I, I don't, can't fell. see the break at all. I literally can't see any of that break, but I'm just going to hit it and hope for the best. That's not going in, is it? <gasps> wow, that was so close, Frank. Oh, it really it was, was so close. You couldn't hit that much better. Ricky's not just happy with it. Feet. Oh my god, I nearly missed that. <laughs> Fuck. Okay, it's par, though. Now the par four seventh hole so guys, we have to be really two over for the rest of the round. It's pretty much, rock rock pretty much un to take the, the impossible, rock out, I would say. And it would have been just a boring straight ahead par four. Now you see the bunker behind this. I don't mean to be really negative, but I really don't think there's any the chance of us getting, the <laughs> getting there. Like this, I'm playing way over here because that wind is crazy. Oh, what a shot! Oh my dear lord, what a shot, Ricky. That's how you do it. 
Nice Thank you. Okay, we might. Uh, I, I don't think we have a chance, but we might have a a slim sliver of hope, maybe. What kind of advice do you give the player who's having a rough go of it? I used to have a little little notepad that I remembered, and uh, on it was stop, take a deep breath, make a decision, and now go with it. Just rewrap. Down, little Sheba. Down. 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 So the second of the par four goes begging. And hmm. Now I'll have to rely on the short game. Yeah, but the short game, as we all know, can uh, redeem a lot of mistakes. Let's see if he does it here. It's not bad. Solid play, hard of the It's not bad, but we need birdies because we need some cover for these holes that are coming up. I'm telling you, they're impossible. The slide, Five over, guys. Okay. We can do this. We can freaking do this, man. <laughs> Not this one. 743 yard par 5. Makes perfect sense, guys, right? I mean, that's fair. Totally fucking fair. Alright, that's a fucking great shot, though. Ah, oh, it's gonna go in the rough. Move that one out there, it's unlucky, but really. Not going to like the lie. Uh, that moved down in the oh rough. shit, I'm not gonna like Second the lie. Shot coming out of the rough here. We're gonna have to lay up to about 185 there, cause which should be perfect for our seven iron. Yep. We're gonna have to aim it over here though, cause of the wind. I ain't taking any part of that wind into my life. Oh, what a shot! This is perfect. We're playing this all really well. We're starting to play some really good shots, but it's just, miss the it's really hard back to do to without, be. like, the yeah, full array of clubs. Frank oh, at least this is actually perfect for a 7-iron. Yeah, 189 to the hole. We want to play this, like, 182. Okay, we'll play, like, over there. The winds are crazy, like, seriously. Look at that. Look at that wind. That is ridiculous. Look how far I am... Look how far right I am, then, Frankie's still. To hit it in the rough yet again. We're off the green. Yeah, this is, for a uh, this is hard to imagine. You know, the fairways aren't that narrow today. Shut up. Stop, stop. Okay, we well, should, have, should have a par here. Good players from the great players. The ability to get it that close from that kind of lie. Yes, come on. All right, that's another par. par Three pars in a row. That's solid golf right there. You see what I mean by this would have been impossible without a wedge? We wouldn't have done it. We would have been fa we would have failed it already by now. So. Oh, not this hole. This is the worst piece of shit hole in the, the hole in the entire fucking course. I guarantee you this much. They increase Ricky's distance as well. Okay. I'm even way over here. I don't give a fuck. Doesn't like it? It's a little too far right. I am too far right. It's understandable. What was he thinking there? I mean, there's loads of room there, but uh, no I just. <sighs> I know this is dumb, guys, but it's all I've got. Well, actually, there's absolutely no way I'm reaching that green, so I'm just gonna fucking lay up with a 7 iron. Screw this. 162. Okay, bring this back. That needs to sit. That needs to sit. Oh. Just a little offline, so now Frank oh, going to have to deal with the rough. It'll be interesting to see how strong he is. Frank, you always talk about it not compounding the error, but here again, I'm aiming at this thing over here. Yeah. <laughs> if, you, if you try, 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 try again. Not a huge miss, Frank, but Go on, get on the green. Did lose this just a little to the right. Oh, what a shot. This is the hardest hole on the course, in my opinion. But that's a okay, brilliant shot from where I was. We have to hold this to stay at five over that. <sighs> Never, easy. Never easy. No fucking shit, dude. Are you kidding me? This is ridiculous. Look how, how hard that's breaking there. Oh, it's even harder than that. That's bogey, though. That's Honestly, I'd take a bogey right there. That that's one of the holes that I would have taken a bogey. It's the triple that's going to kill us. That freaking triple. Out of, see, when you're in that bunker, though, it's impossible to get it out. I don't know. You have to play it sideways or something. 
Okay, we have we have to go one over on the back nine. Simple as that, guys. Complete challenge, one over on the back nine. And we're going to be into the wind. Fuck. And you can see that left side well protected by that wall of rock. Not an overly long par four. All right, that's not bad. Once again, you've got a thread of drive down there to have any chance to really. We're going to be straight into the wind here. I don't know if we're going to reach this with a seven iron. But a bad light. Can we? I think we can actually. In fact, we might be too far with a seven iron. Maybe not out of the. Maybe not with that wind actually. I'm just going to hit a full seven. Fuck it. That's still short. Way short. But we couldn't have gotten any closer. On the green short, oh, we're putting for a birdie. Real Is that the, the first time? The I don't know. Frank Hill have to take Maybe. A um, swing 56. This this no, 54. Wow. Wow. Always two components to the long lag. That's crazy. The speed number one, and then... The read and missed out on that second part. You'll take par. Oh, just about got that one. Just about got that one. We're fine. We're fine. It's totally fine. Stepping up to the tee here at the 11th. It's a par four, not overly long, Frank. And it bends a little to the right, red shot. So why are you, you ending over there? The golf course that are below this, so As if there's a way that I'm going to be able to do that. Playing off another fairway, up an enormous wall, and that would present a problem. So we want to keep it on the right level. The rock face on the right side, you might get the odd bounce that'll bounce it back to the field. Oh, what? Will suit a long tee shot. Where's the wind? The oh, well, that's the end of our tournament, the, unfortunately. Uh, the Frank, this is always such a difficult spot for a golfer. You just hit one out of bounds, you're trying to regroup. Uh, he's gonna that's the end. To more than regroup now. Now, on his third shot after being penalized for going out of bounds. Yeah, yeah. Tough break, really, Rich, on that last shot. It just got <sighs> away from him. That's the end. This is the end. We fail like a bitch. Oh, that's unfortunate, ladies and gents. It really is unfortunate. If we can get up and down oh, for a double, a, we'll have to go one under for the rest. Rich. That shot wasn't that hard. Rest of the round. It's come up uh, well short. Didn't appear committed through impact. Uh, it's I mean, looking like we might not even get that and double. That, that was sublime. Just good hands coming out of the rough, able to manage the distance. Right, we got the double, but we're eight over now. Unfortunately, Everything see, I told you ten was more realistic, but to be ugly. seven is the number. So Frank, and obviously there is trouble yet again on the left. And if you miss it, to we're not going to reach this with a seven. You're not going to be pitching off of a soft piece of grass. at all. No, you're not. This the fortunately though, this is I have to go eight percent faster. Par threes here. At the golf course, if um, I went straight at it, I still would have been short, actually. Never mind. Fortunately, that bunker might save a few shots from going to uh, what would be. Oh, I think that rock stopped us from point. going down the canyon, guys. Yardage, uh, there is a chance to make two. It's uh, it's a that rock stopped us target, from going down the canyon. On the putting surface, really, is going to give you a birdie opportunity. I'm in love with that rock right now, honestly. Fraction off the center. All right, that's just safe, really. Headed to the right. Okay. Well, the stats say that is a green it's a par putt. Regulation, no, it's, it's not because not it's for par. On the card. Very tough putt coming up. Well, it's the green regulation, though. Dumb commentator. Well, that's nine over, unfortunately. They... Oh! If we'd hit it! If we'd freaking hit it! Only one shot, this nine over. So he has that for both two par fives in a row, but these are probably the toughest par fives in the, in the known universe. Not exactly this one, but the one after this is impossible. So you're telling me now, hang on. There's a big rock up there. I can't see that though. I don't know where to aim. So I went down the canyon the last time. Well, that's actually the fairway just there. Okay. Uh, Tom Wise golf was one of my. Oh yeah, beautiful. Growing up, I loved the way he swung. That's when. It's hard to know where to aim on tour mode sometimes, you know. It looks like Rory McIlroy, Frank, sticking the follow through. How about you? 
dickhead up your ass, man. You know, I was thinking, if we, what, what would, could we go for the green here? This is probably the craziest thing I've ever come up with, but if we go for the green here, we'd have to carry 331. We need something now. We need something, so I'm going to fucking do it. I don't care. If we go too far right, we'll be in the water. If we go too far left, we'll be in the water. If we go short, we'll be in the water. But I'm going to try to hit this 8% fast. No, I didn't hit it 8% fast. I hit it 2% fast. That's... <laughs> no, we... Yeah, never, right. ever were we going to make that. that 89-92% is not good so enough to make it. Into the drink. This now the we wouldn't need it 100%. So, Frank, he'll take a drop here. Yeah, he'll take his medicine, take his penalty shot. Alright, we can get up and down for a par still. I guess. We should have just taken and tried to get a birdie there. Because a birdie would have got us back to 8 over. Sit down. Get down. Oh, this is this is gone. Just averted danger right there. So close. Why does he have all the luck? Ricky looking at the lip, eyeing it for par. Can't see what's happening there. Is that dead straight or is it going right a little bit? It looks like it's going left a little bit, actually. Oh, way more than a little bit. It's it's hard to see the lines. Yeah, that's a good. That's why right tour mode's so difficult for the long putts like that. But whatever. It's another bogey. Ten game. over. Just Ten over. We tried, guys. Really how well so, we're not even going to make the, the ten over challenge either. Because <laughs> well, this hole, I'm telling you right now, is literally im fucking possible. Watch this one. Hmm, shit. Hit it. Yeah, that's all right. For this next shot from the rough you know what, actually? The player need to be With that wind, well, I'm just gonna fucking hit driver. Exactly how good they are. I'm gonna hit it at this hot air balloon down here. Exactly the best lie, but it's sort of I don't give a fuck. If, if you know what you're doing. I just don't give a fuck anymore, guys. Oh, that's... <laughs> that. That is what you would call incredibly out of bounds. Are you for real? <laughs> Unfortunately, I am commentator. <laughs> Getting set now for his fourth. Unfortunately, I am. After hitting it out of bounds. Yeah, this is uh, this can get away from him here. Oh, that actually. Why didn't we just do that the first time? Jesus, what a drive that would have been. Look how far that's going too. Good recovery shot. Couldn't make. Why didn't they do that? At least he's back in play. Played the smart <laughs> shot right there. <laughs> Full loft on this. And put it all the way back to like 243. And let the wind do its job. And way out there. Okay, let's do this. A fast 10% fuck. Look how far that's gonna go. Frank, we talk so often about striking the golf ball. This player is. Oh my god, I forgot how far down that was. Element involved, isn't there? Well, it's that's a good hundred yards over the back of the green. Number on the bottom of the club you're hitting. It's knowing how far it goes to avoid mistakes just like that. What am I doing? What am I doing with my life? Not quite dialed in all the way on that shot, but still on the putting surface. Frank, I'm not saying he should pull out driver here, but this is a long putt. Greens are fast, though. You never know. I'm not even going to bother to read that. <laughs> Might have a chance. That was not a very good read right there. This is for a double bogey. Well within his range. Oh my god. Triple bogey. I just pushed it. That hurts. Well, no one likes it, but it happens in this sport. This course sucks. Honestly, I don't think I could do it with all of my clubs. If I'm being honest, I don't think I could beat seven over with all of my clubs in this win. Okay. If I don't bury this all, we're gonna have to give up. Well, we're not going to do it now, but I mean, I've given up already any hope of doing this, but we move that one have to give up for reals. Not going to like the lie. Uh, that moved down in the rough. Second shot coming out of the rough here. Eleven percent fast? Are you shitting me? Well, this one should be safely on deck here. That's actually pretty good. <laughs> Damn! What a <laughs> shot! What a seven iron! Really Eleven percent fast. Just to get it on the green, as you say, I think is a big win. 
Oh, nearly our first birdie! To the putt, excited to make birdie. Now, settle for par. Yeah. Not even one birdie. Right now. Not even one. Let one go. Really well, guys, we failed the challenge. I hope you guys enjoyed watching this me fail. Doesn't. You evil fucking monsters. <laughs> you evil monsters. What's wrong with you guys, huh? Oh, no. Oh, wow. That ball is you know what I'm gonna try here? Something fucking Franken crazy. Golf, we know, short grass, this is a 90 yard grass. shot, and I'm gonna try hit it over grass, here. But it doesn't always work out that like way. straight over here. What's the most important element from the shot? <laughs> you have to be a little okay, we failed. Guys, I'm going to forfeit the challenge there. I hope you guys enjoyed watching. I didn't enjoy playing, so thanks for that. And I'll see you guys in the next challenge video, which is probably going to be St. Andrews and Heavy Winds. And I'll see you guys there. Mahalo.